Hello again. We have another laptop for disassembly. We have to open it, clean the thermal paste, clean the fans, and so on. Uh, this is uh, Acer Nitro 5. It's got uh, 9th gen i7 GPU and uh, GTX graphics. Uh, it's used for gaming, of course. The laptop hasn't been opened for the past one year, probably. Uh, last time I opened it here, probably a year, year and a half or so. So, let's start. We have to remove all the screws. We have to take out the back cover. And we should be able to have access to the, to the fan. All the screws are the same size on this laptop. We have a missing screw here. I have to put a screw after that. So let's start. Use something sharp. Just. As you can see, we have pieces of dust coming from the laptop. The first thing, of course, as usual, we have to take out the battery. You don't want to burn something on the board. Let's tie the screws on the hinges because with the time they're getting loose, of course. There is some broken plastic here. Usually with the time the plastic is getting fragile and uh, easy to break. So let's continue. We have to remove the screws. I am using PH0 screwdriver in 99% of the time because a lot of people ask me on the comments I usually use whatever it fits nothing special I have this screwdriver for probably the past 15 years Let's disconnect the fans because we have to lift everything at once. Now move the cooler a little bit left to right in order for the paste to get a little bit loose because it can be stuck like in this case. Don't rush, take your time. We just have to get it a little bit loose like this. Now flip, and as you can see the cooler is all filled with dust. I usually don't touch the thermal compounds on the chips. Another thing people ask me on the comments. Now we have to open the, the fans because on this model you you can have access to the fans i am using a smaller screwdriver ph00 for the screws so let's remove them so we can clean the fans better
Now let's see what we are dealing with. Yeah, big pieces of dust here and there. Nothing unusual for a gaming laptop. Now I'm going to stop the video for a while just to clean everything with the vacuum cleaner and we'll continue after that. Just a second. Now I did clean the fans. Clean the dust a little bit. Now on this model you can lift the propellers of the fan and you can clean them also. I'm going to show you how I do it. I am using a new little alcohol first and clean the inside like this I'm gonna clean the other one too because sometimes there's a lot of dust inside here and it's blocking the fan from rotating after that we're gonna use little machine oil we have some hair here let me just take it out okay. after that I'm using a little machine oil just a regular oil and put inside the hole like this I'm gonna put a little bit here on the X also now the fans are spinning nicely now let's Let's close them. That's the boring part. And after that, we're going to clean the CPU and the GPU. We're gonna use a dry Q-tip to get the old paste. Now we're going to use some alcohol. <laughs> Let's clean the, the core site. Once we have that cleaned, it's time to put the new paste.
don't put too much I like to spray it before I put the cooler this is my way of applying it now we once we got the paste we just put the cooler back and move the color a little bit left to right in order for the paste to get more even now let's put the screws back Don't forget to connect the fans, of course, otherwise you have to open the laptop again. Once we have them connected, we're gonna connect the battery. And now the only thing we gotta do is just put the back cover. The back cover is not in a very good condition. We have some broken plastics, but the laptop is few years old, so yeah. I have to put a screw because there was one missing but let's power on the laptop so I don't keep you more pressing the power button we have the backlight let's see we have the picture and yeah laptop is going into windows pretty much that's the whole video uh, I forgot to mention the model name this is uh, acer nitro rn 517-51 that's the whole video i hope you like it bye bye for now